What's up, YouTube? It's Robert here, YouTube it on a budget. Look better? Do I look better? All right, guys. What's up, guys? It's Robert here, YouTube on a budget. Today's video is basically about how do you keep losing subscribers? Oh, God, look at that. Let me get from over here. All right, so I just got finished cutting the grass, as you can see. The backyard is horrible. This is actually my first time cutting it. Damn. This is my first time cutting it <laughs> actually this year. That's the sad part. I had a buddy come cut it uh, earlier this year. So this is a second cut. And it shows how bad it is. But I'm going to get it fixed. So give me like about 10 videos and I'll show you an update. Yeah, so basically how you lose subscribers. And um, I get this question asked a lot. Uh, for and I don't know why they asked me because I'm a I'm a baby youtuber um, I don't have that many subscribers, but They asked me I don't know why so um, so yeah, let's get into it I've been a victim of losing subscribers a lot um, at first it used to it used to really really take a toll on me um, it used to make me uncreative I didn't want to do videos or nothing guys but it, it's going to happen and it's many different ways why it's going to happen uh, and I'm just going to give you some examples of the research I done why it happened to me check out that grass big difference huh you can tell I pay a lot of attention to this front yard versus the backyard look at the big difference well the gate closing <clears throat> so yeah so the reason why you a couple reasons the reason why I feel like you lose subscribers um, so you know YouTube has this thing uh, where if your subscribers are not active uh, using YouTube they actually counts out their account I've been a victim of that uh, I lost like a thousand, like I want to say 1,200 something subscribers at one time. It was devastating to me. Um, but it is what it is, guys. Um, I can't do nothing about it. I guess the the people wasn't active in the um, in their YouTube account. But at first, it played a big toll on me. But it just kind of made me more motivated than anything. Um, the second reason why, and I, I, I've been a victim of this too, and it's not the subscribers, the viewers' fault, it's more my fault. Um, I don't really stick to one thing. Um, my channel is mainly car stuff, but when I first started YouTube, uh, I did a couple things on my car, but I did this one DIY, and it's my top viewing video uh where i made my daughter uh uh bed like for like 60 bucks and i'm gonna put the video right here or the picture right here i'm sorry right there i made that bed for 60 dollars and that video i think right now currently has 237,000 views that's my most popular video was the diy and 85 percent of my viewers were women back then like four or five months ago 85 percent so guys y'all was only showing me love for 15 percent at the moment but now when i look at look at it it's uh 89 percent males and uh 11 percent females so that's where i I think I lose a lot of subscribers as well um, because I really don't stick to one type of video and people probably come to my channel for DIYs or they come for the Dodge Charger so that's another thing why I think I lost a lot of subscribers um, the other reason I think people lose subscribers and I don't think I'm a victim of this one uh, basically being consistent on uploads now I promise one upload 
a week one upload now sometimes I do more than one and that's just like a bonus so um, I get off work early or I'm off and I'm in a mood to do a video um, so yeah so I promise one video a week but nine out of ten I do a two or three it depends uh, if I'm being creative that week or not and, and creativity plays a big toll on it guys I just don't like to sit in front of the camera and talk I like to do b-roll shots I like to do some kind of editing I just don't like the sitting in front of the camera and talking I think it's boring um, so that's another reason the other reason why I think people lo lose subscribers a lot is simple fact if I'm doing a channel of my Dodge Charger and you subscribe to my channel but then say if something you sell your charger or it gets totaled or it gets stolen or something I don't know why I'm saying stuff negative but something happened to your charger trade in right so you don't want to watch my channel no more because you don't no longer own that vehicle so I think that's another reason why some people lose subscribers um, and then this next one I'm going to tell you, uh, I started off at, at, with this one, but then I backed up and um, I just changed my whole approach on everything. Negativity, guys. Uh, I think that's another reason why people lose subscribers. Negativity. Uh, comments. So basically what I mean by that is, say if a viewer comes on my page and say something negative, uh, instead of me just letting it go and not commenting back, the the creator, the YouTuber that you watch your channel will say something negative. They go back and forth. And then basically the viewer that's coming in with the negativity is getting the better self of the uh, creator of the YouTube channel. And that's something I, started, I was starting to do. But you got to think about it like this. Everybody is not going to like your content. Um, you're putting your your content on the platform for everybody to view and you're gonna have some of those people who don't like your content now some people want to express their opinions and I'm fine with that um, but I don't me personally I don't go on people channels if I don't like something I just don't say nothing I don't push the dislike button because the reason why I don't never put I never push a dislike button. The reason why I never push a dislike button because it takes y'all don't understand how hard it is to do YouTube, guys. It's not easy like y'all think. It's not easy to talk into a camera. It's not easy to edit. It's not easy to let the world see your content. It's not easy. I just challenge y'all to try to open a YouTube account and see how consistent y'all are on it. So, if I don't like a video, I just don't say that. I just don't. I don't dislike it because it took that creator time out of their life to do a video for the world, and that's how I feel. A lot of people don't understand. I make videos to help other people out. I try to help out much as much possible people as much I have. Why did I just say that? I don't know. Well, I, I try to help out most people as possible. Some people ask questions or some people are scared to ask questions. And that's why I'm here to try to help people and answer those questions. For example, y'all know how much negativity I got on the breaking into the Dodge Charger? I got so much negativity off that video. But I guarantee you I helped a lot of people out as well people probably didn't even know about that so I was just trying to help people to not be a victim in the future and I took the time and did my research and it took me weeks to do my research on how to fix that problem but a lot of people don't see it like that they see it as oh he's just trying to help other people break into the car no I'm trying to prevent people from breaking in your car it was and they, they can still break in your car don't get me wrong they can break your window but if they can break through your keyhole and it takes a matter of seconds. That's way easier than breaking your window. So that's why I inform people for that. And then that's why I never dislike nobody videos. If I don't like it, I just don't say nothing. Um, another reason why I think people lose actual uh, subscribers is some people just grow up. Like 
like for example, if you have a gaming channel, right? If I was 12 years old, I love Minecraft. Don't ask me why I said Minecraft because my daughter used to play Minecraft all the time. So if if I uh, use if I play Minecraft, so eventually, eventually, guys, I'm gonna grow up, and I'm not gonna watch want to watch Minecraft no more. Maybe I want to watch NBA 2K or some Madden or something. So, and that's another reason why some people lose subscribers. But tell me what y'all think. Tell me why. Oh, you know what? Clickbait. clickbait. Everybody's a victim of it. I do it a couple times. And I just did an experiment about uh, I hit a possum and then I could. Uh, click, click clickbait and it wasn't a clickbait video I just said that I just put that in the uh, title just to see how many people would not view that channel I mean view that video and a lot of people didn't view that video which is crazy but yeah clickbait is another reason why people unsubscribe um, that's pretty much what I got guys tell me in the comments below what you think why people unsubscribe um, that's just my opinion why I think Honestly, I don't get discouraged no more about losing subscribers, guys. When I say I lose subscribers all the time, like for example, this morning, I was at uh, 4,945. Or no, 47. I checked back after I came from the gym, I was at uh, 4,943. So, my stuff will fluctuates. It fluctuates, but it's all good. But like I said, all the subscribers, man, I really appreciate. I really, really appreciate y'all taking the time out in y'all life and watching my videos. It means the world to me. Um, I'm trying to help y'all out with some stuff, and y'all help me out. Keep motivating. Keep watching my videos. But yeah, that's Robert YouTube on the budget, guys. Peace. You know what? I'm back, guys. So, for all the new YouTubers, guys, don't get discouraged when you lose subscribers. Don't get discouraged if your subscribers don't come quick. Just put in the work. If you make more content, you'll be successful. I guarantee you, if I made a video every single day, I would probably be more successful than I am now. But, as you know, YouTube is a hobby for me. I have the family to take care of. So... Just don't get discouraged, guys. Keep If you want to really do YouTube, you can get in front of the camera. If you're not shy, you're outgoing, you're energetic. YouTube is, is fun, guys. It's really fun. Don't get discouraged. Stay pushing. And just find your little, a good fan base that's loyal to you. You make sure you're loyal to them as well. That's another important thing. You have to be loyal to your, your viewers. Because if you don't comment in your in your comment section, what's the point? Like, I see a lot of, I'm not trying to throw no slugs at big YouTubers. I know they have thousands and thousands of of comments. But 85% 80, of them people is hating anyway. Don't comment to those. Comment to those people who is saying something genuine, saying something nice to you. Make sure you comment. Um, I try to comment to every single person. I, you can ask someone, you know what, guys, all the people who I called and tried to help, gave them my personal phone number, comment below, man. I try to help people out as much as possible, gave people my personal phone number to help them out with different projects on their charger and their upgrades and stuff. So I, I help out as much as I can. So, guys, for all the new YouTubers, guys, just stay positive, stay strong, and that's it. Bye. I need y'all to subscribe! Subscribe!